Another day, another video, huh? Sheesh. So, what's up guys? Um, today I'll just be showing you how to connect your PS4 controller to your PC to play some Horizon 4, some banging ass ra racing games. Okay, so basically all you have to do, you have, uh, have to have Steam open in the background and you have to have DS4 Windows. I'll link that to in the description for you guys to download. So all you have to do, you have to have Horizon 4 minimized just like I do here. You have your uh, Steam running in the background and your DS4 Windows also running in the background. Let's just open this quickly. As you can see, DS4 Windows right here. So all you need to do is plug your um, your PS4 controller in. Just like that. You get a notification from Windows and Steam saying you whatever user's controller. Just say close and you should hear the Windows thing um, notification telling you that you have connected a device. If you do not hear this device uh, notification from Windows or Steam, all you have to go is all you have to do is just go to Device Manager. Make sure that your controller is still plugged in. Go to Human Interface Devices, and you will see HID compliant game controller. All you have to do is right click on that and say enable device. Obviously mine's enabled so it says disable but uh, yours obviously won't be so you just click enable and you should get a notification from Windows. So let's close that. So all you have to do now, as you can see if I go into here, um, Forza Horizon 4 is really confused as to whether I'm actually using a PS4 controller, I mean an Xbox controller or just using my PC. So all you have to do now is shut down um, Steam, close the window there, just make sure it's completely closed, so check your taskbar here and just exit it over here. So now our Steam is completely closed. Once Steam is completely closed, you just go to settings on DS4 Windows, say hide PS4 controller, I mean, yeah, hide PS4 controller, say yes, just give it a few seconds. Okay, once it stopped loading, you just untick it. Wait a few seconds again. Okay, we go back into um, Forza Horizon 4, and as you can see, perfectly fine. It's not confused at all. It's it thinks it's a Xbox 360 controller. And another way to tell that this is 100% is legit is that if you um, have the uh, Xbox 360 control uh, signals back in the in the bottom left hand corner. So if it's a A select B back X Forza Vista and so forth. Um, and as you can see, you don't need to adjust any settings um, uh, in the actual Forza. So, as you can see, it's so yeah, you um, don't need to change any settings in the actual Forza Horizon 4 um, app. Uh, if all settings will be like automatically placed in there from Steam. That's why we originally opened it um, uh, in the beginning and then closed it thereafter. So yeah, thanks guys for watching, I appreciate it and I hope it worked for you. Just comment down below if it didn't and I'll try my best to help you. Thanks so much guys. Shawty know I kill people, real people, from the trenches where it's real lethal, so real wriggles, big body with your...